Hello everyone and welcome back to the Nerd Cave. In this short tutorial, we are going to use the Raspberry Pi 5 to control an LED. Controlling an LED might seem very simple, but this is the equivalent to Hello World in programming, because by learning how to control a GPI open as the input or output, then we can connect any type of sensors to it and build more amazing projects. So in this one, we are going to focus on the output using the GPI open of our Raspberry Pi. To follow along with this video, you will need the following components shown here. If you are looking for a Raspberry Pi 5 starter kit, I would recommend this one from SunFounder. I will put a link in the description, which will be affiliate link. I have used their products in the past, so I can say the quality is good. And most of the components in this kit I will use in future tutorial series. The following image is the connection diagram. Make all the necessary connections as shown. From the diagram, we are connecting GP17 to the positive of our LED. And remember, the positive leg will be the longest leg on the LED. So this side is positive. And then we want this to go through the resistor to ground. And here we connect this whole rail here will then be connected to ground. Now that our circuit is finished, we can then go and write the code. I have already written the code and put it on my website. So let's quickly go grab that code from the website and then we will look through it. On your Raspberry Pi, open your web browser and then go to nerdcave.xyz. Then scroll down, go to Raspberry Pi and click on get started. Then go to tutorials and go tutorial LED control. Then we will scroll down here. You can also zoom out a bit, then you'll see what is on this page and we can click on code. And in here we can copy the code. Now that we have copied the code, we can click here on start, go to program and go to Phony. And then here we can paste our code. So let's take a look at what's happening at the code. We import our GPIO zero library and we also import LED. And this will allow us then to control our GPIO pins. And then from time, we will import sleep. And this will allow us to add delay in our program. And then here we initialize our LED connected to GPIO pin 17 using that GPIO zero library. If you want to see all the functionality that this library has to offer, I will put a link of this in the description. To continue with our program, we then create a while through loop, which will be an infinite loop that will run forever. And then here we say LED dot on, and this will turn our LED on. And we will also then print here LED on. We will then wait 0.5 seconds and then turn our LED off, print LED off and then wait another 0.5 seconds before this will then run again and we will have our LED on again. And this will then happen forever. So if we run this code or run this script, we will get the following. So here we can see LED on, off, on, off and here is the output. And that is how we can control an LED with the Raspberry Pi 5. Now, I know this is very basic, but as we progress, we will build much more complicated and cooler projects with the Raspberry Pi 5. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.